Ready to read level two, Jack and the Beanstalk, read by Grandma Linda. Jack Pot was very poor. He lived in a shed with his mother, Dotty, and a cow called Skimmed Milk. Skim Milk wasn't given any milk, so Dotty sent Jack to sell skim milk at the market. Jack met a little old lady who said, give me that cow and I'll give you these magic beans. Magic, said Mom Jack. Mom said, Jack, look what I got for skim milk. Dottie could not believe it. She threw the beans out the window and sent Jack to bed without That's supper. morning, it was dark outside. Looking out, Jack saw why. A big beanstalk had sprung up in the garden and reached up to the sky. Jack climbed the beanstalk to see where it led. At the top, floating on a cloud, was a huge castle. In a massive room inside the castle stood a tall table and a chair. Someone bigly lives here, said Jack. Then he saw a treasure chest full of gold. Jack grabbed the gold and put it in his pocket. Suddenly, the door burst open and a gigantic giant marched in. He had a horrible head, enormous eyes, nasty nostrils, terrible teeth, legs like lampposts, and a bulging pot belly. He was as tall as a tree and as big as a bus. The giant stood still, then he roared. Fee, fi, fo, fum, I smell the blood of an Englishman. Be he alive or be he dead, I'll mix his bones into my bread. Then the giant spotted Jack in the chest. Jack jumped out and ran. The giant tripped and fell over with a terrible crash. Jack ran towards the beanstalk. He climbed down as fast as he could. But the giant began to follow him. Jack heard the giant roar. Fee, fi, fo, fum, I smell the blood of an Englishman. I'll have him flattened, I'll have him fried, I'll have him pot roast with a salad on the side. At the bottom of the beanstalk, Jack shouted to his mother, get an ax. You mustn't play with axes, said his mother. It's dangerous. No, said Jack, pointing to the giant. That's dangerous. Jack and his mother heard a roar. Fee, fi, fo, fum, I smell the blood of an English mom. I'll have her steamed, I'll have her stewed, I'll have her boiled or barbecued. Jack chopped at the beanstalk. His mother cut it with a bread knife. There was a creaking and a cracking and the beanstalk fell like a tree. The giant fell to the, to the ground, quite the gold dead. gold fell out of Jack's pockets. Look, pots of money, shouted Jack. We've hit the jackpot, jackpot, grinned his mother. Jack bought back skimmed milk from the little old lady, and Jack's mother bought a big balloon and went on day trips. But where she went, she would not say. And that was a great story. Thanks for reading with me.